All right, ladies and gentlemen, what is going on? GI Joe Gamer here, and today we are back with some Grotopia. I just keep coming back to look at the game. I usually record a video on it, and then I peace out. That's what I do. But that's probably what I'm going to keep doing. But there is some news that I just heard about. It's been out for a while now. Just found out. Ubisoft, or Ubisoft, however you want to pronounce it, is acquiring Grotopia. Let's go ahead and check that out. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, check this out. Grotopia has been purchased. So here's the deal. We've known for a while that Grotopia needed more developers, more mods, more marketing, more merch, more everything. The two of us alone just can't take Grotopia to the incredible heights that we believe it's capable. And we weren't cut out to be bosses. We just want to work on our games. We finally found a company that not only gets Grotopia, but is allowing us to continue to be a part of the game for years to come, while at the same time stay at our own companies and be indies. That is amazing, best of both worlds for us. What does this mean to me, a player? No big changes. The only thing you should notice is improved modding, quicker customer support, and eventually even better updates. Seth will still show up to spawn lava everywhere and troll people as he does. Homumu will still be cranking out weird items and updates. Does this mean you guys are just sold out and are leaving? Well, we certainly sold something but not out. We aren't planning on leaving anytime soon. We will continue to do Grotopia updates ourselves as we help their developers understand the code base so they can pitch into. The idea is that eventually, sometime down the road, they will be able to take over the programming duties and we can move on to a more advisory and design position. Ain't nobody leaving. Does this mean the game will be ruined with pay to win or ads or whatever else? What? Why would you even ask that? Jeez. One of the reasons that we've partnered with Ubisoft, besides the awe-inspiring development, marketing, and legal muscle, is that they share the same long-term vision for this special game and its community as we do. We all want to see Grotopia reach its full potential. So let's do it together. Seth and Ham. So it does indeed look like that Grotopia was sold, so I'm guessing they sold it and then they're still getting paid as continuing developers, which means they probably made quite a pretty penny off of it, because Grotopia was a pretty, is a pretty big uh, game. Also, March item of the month is apparently a thing now, items of the month. Um, but yeah, that's actually really interesting. So, um, like, uh, so much has changed. Is there a way to see... Alright, so there's 30,000 people online right now. It is, like, midday, uh, US, so a lot of people are probably at school. Like, I don't even know what to do in this game anymore. Like, they have new items of the month. Golden Razor Wings. Slice through the air with the greatest of ease. Double jump. 100,000 gems. You know how many people have probably bought that and how cheap it probably is? Because that is, like, 100 world levels. They have a chem... chem synth. Apparently it's new chemicals and stuff. They, like, updated the surgery. So the surgery is way more difficult. I don't really understand. Like, it's 12,000 now, and you have so much extra crud. Five of each 13 tool. So I really don't do surgery. So I really don't do surgery anymore. Xavier has been, like, asking me to get back into this game. And I really- the thing is with Grotopia, is once you get to the level where I'm at, it's no longer about building worlds and just, you know, hanging out. It's more about, you know, the profits, the the, the economy, the wheeling and dealing. So, I don't really know if I- I don't know if I want to go ahead and invest the time into this game. I just don't know. But, I, you know, I do enjoy, you know, just popping on, seeing what's up, looking at the new updates. It's cool to see the game still growing, because, honestly, like, I- this is a good game. Um, like, if we go ahead and look, uh, 1,007 days ago, 1,782 hours in the game. 1,007 days is, what is that? 1,007 divided by 365, well, 360 times 3 would be, like, 9, um, 180. So it's a little less than 3 years, which is crazy to me. That's absolutely absurd. I created this account three years ago. I was 12. I distinctly remember. Like, I was 12. And now I'm 15. Made, like, it's, it's just crazy. Less than three years ago, I was playing Grotopia on my old tablet. My little old tablet that's sitting on the desk behind me. Staying up all night, laying on my bed, playing Grotopia on my tablet. Like, it's crazy. It's crazy. It was just cool to hop back on, see that, see that, you know, they're, um, they sold their game, so they're getting bigger. I wonder if they've made any more mods, though. All are hidden. Hmm. Because, like, that was, that was always the issue originally with Grotopia, is there wasn't enough mods. Wait, have the buttons always moved? I don't know. Um, regardless, let me guess, the Proto Drake still hasn't been buffed. 
Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And with a pickaxe. One, two, three, four, five, six. Guys, honestly, if the Proto Drake flipping got buffed, I would come back to the game. The, the Proto Drake, right, it's a dragon that you get for doing all of the 2013 achievements. So you have to do a good bit of achievements. And you get this dragon that is untradeable, you can't drop it. You can't trade it. All it's good for is showing off or battle pet. It's a dragon, right? And it doesn't have dragon abilities. Who wants... Like, this dragon is awesome, but who wants a dragon that doesn't have all the extra knockback and extra damage like all the regular other dragons? I've never understood that. And I've brought up posts about it, like, multiple times, but they just never do. So I don't understand. If this dragon got a buff, I would come back to the game. I'm saying it right now. If this dragon ever gets buffed, I will come back to the game. And actually try hard in. But, I don't know, like, it's a, it, oh, it's such a dope dragon, but it's not good for anything. Makes me sad. Anyway, I think that's going to go ahead and do it for this video, guys. I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like, subscribe down below as always. And, uh, yeah, Grotopia. It's a good game. You should try it out. Link in the description. You just simply have to create an account, create an account, log in, you're good to go. A couple tutorials on it out on the internet. Maybe I'll start making some tutorials on Grotopia. It's actually not a bad idea. I could do that. I hope you guys have enjoyed. I'll definitely catch you in the next one. Goodbye.